Hi guys, so I have to talk quietly because the whole world's asleep. But um, I love all the different probabilities right now. And honest to God, I'm being very, 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 very um, narcissistic. I'm sorry. But I felt so beautiful today when a Cherokee Indian told me that I had Cherokee cheeks. And that um, Cherokee Indians... There were some that had red tint in their hair. So let's just face the facts, folks. Um, how could I ever be a Disney Scarlet? You know, I have like the worst reputation ever. And I'm okay with letting go of some of my history to become a Disney star. But not all of it. But I kind of want to see the internet war. Because, <laughs> you know, the, <laughs> it turns me on. So like... And I don't mind them deleting some of my porn because, let's be frank, it hurt me a lot. And it hurts me to know that other people are watching me in pain because they're going to feel it too. But not all of it because some of it I enjoyed, especially the scenes I did where I wore a mask, where they face painted my face or when I did sexy when I was the um, black swan. I deliberately did these scenes so they would cover my face so that... You know, um, in the future, maybe. Um, but, you know, it's very impossible. But I want to believe it's possible. And I'm okay with letting go of some of my history to create better futuristic probabilities. But, um, you know, let's face the facts, folks. I have a lot of work to do. But I don't want to give up on my dream because I've always wanted to be in a movie. And Disney's my favorite, you know. It is, and I'm actually really happy that, um, they, um, have Star Wars and all this other stuff too, because it's just like, you know, I just, I'll spill it out. I think it'd be really cool to do like a Pocahontas movie, but let's like, let's mix it up a bit and like make it Star Wars, you know, like, okay, so I'm Pocahontas, I'm running through the woods naked, and then all of a sudden an alien egg falls from the sky and hits me in the head. And then, you know, um, I'm the catalyst of uh, Lilith, the first wife of Adam, and then I get hit in the head with a, a metal ball from <laughs> great aliens that go, knock, knock, we're here. And then I have to learn how to love the most feared and emotionless aliens in the galaxy. <laughs> and yeah, they abducted me so much when I was younger, but I'm thankful for what they taught me. And I hope I can share it with all y'all. So peace out.